Hey guys, this is me, Jesse, and now we get, and I'm here to do a SummerSlam prediction. Yeah, and, um, Boris, if you're watching this, I'm not from America, I'm from France, but I moved to America, so yeah, just get that. And, um, or, and I'm, I, was not, I was not used to saying dollars, I was used to say euros, but they changed it. Well, I got, I got changed because... I have to learn how to say dollars. So, yeah. But, okay. Um, I have $26 now for the Edge figure. Really close. Really, really close. And $1 away. And then I'll order it. And then we'll pay the extra eight shipping. $8 shipping. Okay. And then, um, okay, let's start with the SummerSlam prediction. Um, okay. Brock Lesnar versus John Cena. I'm gonna say with Brock Lesnar. Cause I don't think because Brock Lesnar is gonna hold it for for a while and then somebody, I don't know, maybe I don't know if Seth, I don't think Seth, I don't know if Seth Rollins is gonna be able to do it to cash it in. I don't think so. Because it's like at that moment it's hard. It's gonna be hard to cash in on Brock Lesnar. Not gonna be easy, but we'll see if he get, if he gets to cash it in. Um, speaking of Seth Rollins, Seth Rollins versus Dean Ambrose lumberjack match. Gonna go with Dean Ambrose because Seth Rollins has the money in the bank. He's guaranteed to be world heavyweight champion, so they gotta put up Dean Ambrose so then he can. Be a little higher than what he is. Dolph Ziggler versus The Miz. Whew. It's gonna be a good match. I know that, but I like Dolph Ziggler has been pushing. They've been pushing him a little. When I just, I think both of them actually kind of deserve to become WWE champion. They're the future of the company. So they kind of deserve to start getting pushed towards the top. But I'm going to say um, Dolph Ziggler. Uh, I'm just going to go with Dolph Ziggler. But I, I'd rather them be World Heavyweight Champion or WWE Champion. But you can't get that. So I'm just going to go with Dolph Ziggler. Last year, I mean, a couple of months, one month ago, for Battleground Prediction, I said Dolph Ziggler was going to win the Intercontinental Championship. It was very close. One away. I was mad about it. I was kind of, I was like, oh, so close. But, you know, I didn't get it. Okay, and then, uh, next. About Chris Jericho and Bray Wyatt. I'm going to say Bray Wyatt. Last time, Bray Wyatt lost. But this time, I'm pretty sure he might win this one. Yeah. Stephanie McMahon versus Brie Bella. And I don't, I don't, I don't even know if this is true that he's like cheating. If they know cheating on Brie Bella, I don't know if he's having an affair or whatever. But I, I don't think that's real. But whatever. We'll see if he, whenever he comes back, if that's true or not. Because, uh, yeah, okay, Brie Bell's gonna win this one. I, I think Stephanie McMahon's pretty good wrestler and all that stuff for Diva and all. That. But she's just, she's gonna put it up for Brie Bell. She's just gonna give it to Brie Bell. Yeah. AJ Lee versus. Page. AJ Lee. I'm gonna keep it. Then, probably ne the next month she'll get it or something. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Okay. Next. Um, let me think. Jack Swagger versus, um, Rusev. I'm gonna say Jack Swagger because it's capture the flag. I never, I don't, I don't think that was ever made in WWE, but maybe it's the first. 
capture the flag. I guess it's whoever gets the flag first. So I'm going to say Jack Swagger. And it's not going to embarrass Rusev because it, it has nothing to do with strength wise, really. Speed wise, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, let me. I, I'm, I think that's it. And then said they have extra matches. I don't know. Maybe they could have Bo Dallas as a star truth. I don't know. But please like the video, subscribe for more. And um twenty five twenty six dollars away. I'm one dollar away from